My name is Ross Russell. My wife is Sally. Between us, we've built this house we call the Sliding House in the far east of Suffolk in England, under a big sky and in open countryside. I've never built a house before, but basically I came to it simply with some capital, some time and some enthusiasm. The architect on this house is a, a man called Alex Dereika from DRNM. He's an old school friend of mine and we worked together over a period of 12 months in designing and making real this building. Ross wanted a house that was unusual. He's quite clear that he wanted to do something special. In its widest sense, the brief was to make um, a house to enjoy in, as a counterpoint to living in London. It's about degrees of shelter, it's about being, responding to seasons and weather and site characteristics, so it um, it's doesn't just move for the sake of it. We have a very narrow building, which is traditional in Suffolk. We have a 45 degree pitched roof. We have timber cladding. We've only subverted that a little bit by large expanses of glass and so on that are only apparent when you open the roof. The sliding roof is a sleeve going from ground level up to eaves and across the pitched roof. It's powered by four electric motors running off standard 12 volt car batteries. And it sounds very silly that you can move 20 tons of roof using a motor that's this long, but it works very well. It takes six minutes to open. It does so very smoothly and very quietly. In the winter, we'll have the roof pulled over to keep us warm. We'll be sitting in a cosy living room with the television on in the corner. Of a summer's evening, it's a, a magical experience to be able to just pull the roof back and sit in the sunshine. I remember well the brief I gave when I met up with Alex to talk about this house. But what I remember most is the line at the top of the page that said, we are prepared to be radical. <laughs>